Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be back on Reddit taking a look at the Smash Bros subreddit. Just taking a look at some funny stuff, maybe some plays, anything like that. Let's take a look at maybe my favorite that have been going on. Like last time we had a really fun tier list where it's like what Smash character would you sleep with? That was a little bit ridiculous, but hopefully we can run into something crazy like that again. Let's take a look at what Reddit has for us today, guys. Let's get into it. <laughs> I swear I don't plan these things like we're starting off with another one like that. I was just talking about it. who would you save zero suit or Pyra I'm saving Pyra don't care zero suit you go blah, 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 blah. like literally dude if there were like a thousand zero suits in the water And I could save them all just with like my one hand I am dipping over to the other end and saving Pyra I can like I will let zero suit drown about 10,000 times even if it means saving Pyra one time It's just I care about Pyra so much more zero suit even zero suit use that to save you you know I thought it was a little weird that the top post that didn't have that many likes but I realized it was on the wrong subreddit and you know what hopping into the Smash Bros ultimate subreddit we don't get any better here and we're in no context there's this Bayonetta stomping on Luigi like what's going on today what's going on with these few posts like, poor Luigi man like you know what at least someone has to like even it out from like Mario dying all the time in the trailers at least Luigi needs to take it a little bit but I mean I'd rather die than have those gun pistols stomped on my nuts you know what I mean <laughs> and guys while I'm here I will just want to make sure that I, I you know that everyone's posts I will have the username in it to like give credit here I won't read them all every single time so if you want to go show them some love go comment go save the post whatever you want to do go show them some love they definitely deserve it especially this like how did you how do you think to do this do you think that happened by accident I don't know for everyone that believed that DDD was blue and white you are wrong as it's a shirt no I didn't even think about that, and like, what is this? Is this like something official? I don't know if this is even real, but... I guess that does make sense. His face is blue, why wouldn't his body be blue, right? Oh my god, that's actually so crazy! Uh, my mind is absolutely blown right now. Luma tried so hard, let's see what's going on with Luma. I don't even know where Luma is, I don't even see him. Is always he just waiting to spawn back? He's back. Oh, you animal Luma, let's go! Is he gonna get rested? <laughs> <laughs> the four horsemen of galaxy brains these four are always gonna pull off something crazy you know what that's true every time you're watching like any compilation or even on tiktok or just like any youtube shorts or something like that and it's a smash bros play you see pac-man mega man ice climbers or steve i have to say steve a little bit less than the others but man you know something like crazy big brain is coming that's especially pac-man i swear like those good pac-man players have like 500 iq i swear i've actually tried to learn pac-man because i like one time especially in smash 4 i was like man these plays look so sick I'd love to do that stuff, but little did I know Pac-Man is really really hard and I'm gonna go with my simple hard-hitting Bowser He's the best. I actually started mating Bowser in Smash 4 and I know that's not completely off topic here So we're gonna just move on to the next one. See this is what I mean with the Smash tier list There's always something going on with these tier lists. The ultimate fruit tier list uses fruit. Yeah, it literally uses fruit Eat many fruits. Oh, yeah, of course Donkey Kong is number one there probably eat fruit You know what everybody is is ramen of, is ramen of fruit so true vegetable eater. What do you think Bowser eats only oh? I, I read that as vegetable. Oops. Oops. Anyways, disgusting vegetables. Oh, you can imagine PP eating his own. <laughs> no relation with fruits. Yep, yep. It will die upon contact with fruit. Dr. Mario. I do not understand this tier list. <laughs> Sega, I literally have dozens of games where Sonic could pull from movesets. Could you please update them, please? No. I made a tier list based on who would work as the new mascot for Nintendo. Rest in peace, Mario. Very true. Mario is dead. We need a new Nintendo mascot. Imagine Mario like actually dies for good at the end of like the last Smash Ultimate character reveal. For the new Nintendo mascot, I'd have to say it would be between Villager and Kirby. Okay, yeah, you know what, I, this t this does make pretty much, it makes a lot of sense to be honest with you. I don't know, like, if you could maybe move Shulk up a little bit. I don't know, but I think it's definitely between Kirby and Villager, because you forget how well Animal Crossing does when it comes out, especially the new one. New one's fantastic, by the way, if you haven't played that. It's, it's between those two, so let me know what you think down in the comments below, but guys, Kirby or Villager, or am I completely wrong and you wanted someone like Donkey Kong? Donkey Kong could work, you know what? Or maybe Link too. Maybe I'm just completely wrong. <laughs> Comment down below, guys. Palatina, when you use her guidance on a DLC character, I've never met this man in my life. Fun facts with Luigi. Nintendo and Sakurai can add whoever they want, true, into Smash, and nobody outside the dev team knows who they're gonna add, so unless you work for Sakurai and know the characters, do us all a favor and shut up. You don't know who they're gonna add, so stop acting like it, you jackass, and you know what? 
Eh, I don't want to say that I know, but I do enjoy speculating at the same time that is a fun fact of Luigi, so the people who post random disgusting fake leaks, I don't want to say disgusting, but like those like leaks with no evidence about it, yeah, you know what, if you're talking about those people, yes, but if you're talking about someone like me, who just likes talking about Smash Bros and DLC and just like has fun making predictions and stuff like that and understands at the same time, they can add whoever they want. I'm, maybe I'm diving a little bit too deep into this. Fun facts to Luigi. <laughs> no way, this guy made my his dog's hair and <laughs> Ludwig's hair. That's Ludwig, right? I'm pretty sure it's Ludwig, but that's actually so funny. Oh, all right, let's see how your Wii Fit is here. All right, we're moving. Ooh. Oh! Oh, he's gonna hit him again! Dude. Oh. Oh! Oh, that's, that was so cool, and I thought you were going to hit him again, but you got dunked on, you loser. So I thought this post was really special, actually. I was taking a look at it for a second. Do any of you have a special story behind who you main? For me, I main Pyro and Mithra because they are very special to me. Around the time that they were releasing the Smash, I decided to start playing Xenoblade Chronicles 2, which I should get around to, by the way, because everyone's been talking about it's an amazing game. I haven't played it yet. While I was playing, my dog Ralphie caught Palvavirus and started to suffer, and inevitably we had to put him down. I'm so sorry to hear that, even though you're probably not going to watch this video. I understand how you feel. The only, the only thing that I could use to clear my mind and my thoughts was the story in Xenoblade Chronicles 2. That's my story behind why I made the character. I'm interested in hearing y'all's stories. Mine, mine is a little sad. I'll be at school today because my spring break is over, so I won't be responding for a while. Have an awesome day, everybody. That's actually so sad. Aww. I had to put down my dog a long time ago, and that was like the hardest thing I ever had to do, so I... It's a little tough, but... A special story behind who you main. I actually don't really have a special story behind who I main. Um, I... Yeah, I wish I could relate to it, but I can't really. <laughs> I guess, like, I, when I picked up Bowser in Smash 4, because I didn't play Bowser before Smash 4, he had that, like, crazy up throw combo, and I was, like, kind of get really trying to get the hang of that. I was just messing around with my girlfriend because she likes to play Bowser, and then I played Bowser too, but then I was like, hey, you know what? I'm going to try this, like, 90. I can't remember the percent. It was, like, 95 or something. You do the up throw to up air, and it was just, like, it was hitting so, so well, and I kept destroying my girlfriend at it. You know, like, it's not saying much beating a girl at a video game. Just kidding, just kidding. But anyway, so I kept playing around with Bowser because she was playing around with Bowser and I just kept hitting her over and over again with that 95% up throw combo and it was just like hitting so well. And then eventually when I got home later that day, I started playing with my brother and I started playing Bowser a little bit more because I, I dabbled with him just a little bit, but not enough to my main. I made Ness and Pit back in Smash 4, but like before I really started getting into Bowser. At the end of Smash 4, I was like hardcore Bowser main. That's how I played and it was just like, say, it's not a crazy like emotional attachment story like this but it was just like the story that I started become Bowser and I like eventually it was actually easier that pivot grab if you remember in Smash 4 Bowser's pivot grab was so so broken it was so awesome I loved watching people rage because again it was a lot more like you, it was a lot more of a thing back in Smash 4 when you would do a pivot grab and grab somebody but then Bowser you would like turn around and grab somebody and you wouldn't even his hand wouldn't even be near touching somebody and then it was fun watching people freak out so that was another reason why I started meeting Bowser and after that it was just more and more I played him more and more and then eventually I got really good with him and he, he this my hard hitting main character Bowser so guys if you have a special story like this I know mine I don't even know if mine was that interesting I don't think it really was let me know down in the comments. Talk about, do any of you have a special story behind who you main? I would love to read and talk about it there. Alright, my last meme caused a bit of anger, so here's something to cheer you guys up. Internet. Lots of hype and support around for Pyra. Pyra gets added. The internet trying to do it again with Waluigi. <laughs> oh yeah, who's up for round two? Alright guys, we're gonna end it off with one more play here. Use his own soccer ball in him. That looks pretty good. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, oh, it looks so good. We fit's actually so much fun to watch. So, and that's why I guess these are all uh, really, high, really high posted. That was, I, I can watch We Fit all day. I swear to God, one of my most favorite characters to watch. We Fit's so much fun to play too. If you, if you haven't played We Fit, pick her up. But guys, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I want to know what you think and I want to know what your favorite. Oh, so two things. One, would you say Pyra Zero Suit? Two, tell me about a special story on why you made your character. I would love to read and talk about it there, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're new here and you enjoyed it, please consider hitting the like button. It would help out the channel a ton and subscribe if you like to see more Nintendo Smash Bros and Fortnite content again Speaking of Fortnite, I have a supporter creator code if you'd like to use me in the item If you'd like to support me in the item shop, my code is clen coco again If you play Fortnite, I am a hashtag epic partner hashtag ad pretty sure I have to say that now a couple more things to plug I have a supporter er, I have a supporter creator. What is wrong with me? I keep like I keep I'm talking too fast I'm trying to get through these so, so it's not a long ending of this video here and most of you probably kick, clicked off by now <laughs> I'm trying to make this quick and then I mess it up. I have another channel. It's called Talking Fights with Kyle. If you like UFC, MMA, any of that stuff, the link for that will be in the description down below. Feel free to go check it out. And lastly, I made a TikTok. All lowercase is Clen underscore YT. If you have, if you have TikTok, you want to watch some of my videos, go check it out there. Thank you again for watching, everybody. Don't forget to comment down below, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.